up guys? Street Reaper here. We're on a little bit of an adventure, not gonna lie. We're gonna be checking out this new spot. Uh, first ever flying at it, hopefully we'll be today. We got the Mustangs. So one of these will get up in the air. Reaper here. <clears throat> this is what I'm looking at. Not much to see here, but this will be a really cool view once we get up a couple hundred feet. We got the Mustang here. The head tracking setup with the uh, air unit and the fan keeps it nice and cool. I'm gonna be sitting down here. I've got all my music through my Bluetooth on the transmitter, so you guys won't hear any of that. And it also has all my commands for uh, switches, switch changes and things like that. So yeah, um, got the Arduino, uh, head tracker module, uh, basically that whole system, this board here, along with this gimbal here that pans and tilts. That's all from uh, Motion Sick, uh, fpvdogfight.com or something like that. I'll put the links in the description. But yeah, we're running the 4S today with a 12 by eight prop. The other day I hit 101 miles per hour with this prop, running a 3200 4S. Soon that's gonna be a 6S plane. So, let's go ahead and turn the screen down, save some juice. So yeah, so, here we are guys. <clears throat> this location is actually at, um, I'll put it in the description. You could see That's the Hickory Log Reservoir. You can directly see it line of sight right here. But um, for now, get this bird in the sky, see what we got. This is that 3200 4S. Simply put some Velcro on the back of this dude. And the way I have my CG set up on this plane particularly, uh, with the head tracking setup, I need this battery to go as far to the front as possible. So in other words, I'm choking this up so that this may stop, but the battery will be continued further. This will basically touch the back of the motor. That's uh, what I'm going for. So that way the CG is, the battery is as far forward as possibly you can get. And I've even added some weights in the front of the plane to help keep the balance and the CG correct. Along with, on the belly I'm running, Another receiver with two antennas. So yeah, we're getting optimum. As much antennas and as best signal as we can get with Spectrum. That's what we're after here. And then I'll go through and double check everything. Checking surfaces. Elevator, rudder. You can check your rates, but uh, I use high rates on this plane, so yeah. Everything seems to be working. It all, every switch that I switch on my transmitter will tell me in my headset and my...
right, y'all. Just let me know. Like I said, do y'all like talking and walking around with a GoPro, or do y'all just like getting right to business and throwing a plane up in the sky? Man, I'd like to be diving through that thing, but they parked it too low. But yep. Anyways, peace out, y'all. See y'all in the next video.